Tell us more about the new gold ETF. The gold ETF is different to, I mean, to other, uh, I mean, asset class in the sense that it is it's a commodity and it forms part of the alternative when it comes to industrial investors. Yeah. So when it comes to a retail investor, I mean, it's one of the, the asset that you want to have in a portfolio. Uh, I mean, if you've got uh, investment like any other asset, you want to insure your, I mean, your, your investment. So you can actually have gold ETF, platinum or platinum as an insurance. It also basically help you, uh, say for instance, given that the underlying asset is, is priced in US dollar. So it actually act as a hedge for devaluation of, of the rent against the USD. So it's not only a commodity, it gives you different other things. Commodity as well as a hedge as well. So it's actually good in, in, in that sense. So it's important to have it in a portfolio. And it tends to have negative to low correlation with equities. So if the, 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 the equity is actually in, in, in a bull market, it tends to move in the same direction with equities. But when the equity is actually in a, a bear market, it actually acts as a, a hedge against or it gives you a diversification or risk management tool kind of things. So it's important to have it in a portfolio. So our gold ETF is the, the largest uh, ETF uh, in our market, the JSC. Uh, it was the third uh, gold ETF uh, to be listed globally. Um, one other thing is that uh, it is secondarily listed in various other exchanges besides South Africa. It's listed in Botswana, in Nigeria, Namibia, most recently Kenya, as well as uh, um, in, in Ghana as well, which makes ours different to other ETFs where they're only listed maybe in one market. Michael, thanks for your time and for sharing your knowledge on the ETFs. Thank you. And thank you for joining us on Black Onyx. For more details, please visit the website.